Oh, hi there, Gumboot Kids. Hey, kids, come on, it's song. Get your boots on, get your gum boots on. Hey, kids, come on, it's song. Get your boots on, get your gum boots on. Let's go outside and let's have some fun. Solve the mysteries one by one. Come on! Good day, Gumboot Kids. I've just picked up a sweet treat from the farmer's market. It'll be delicious with my tea. On my way home, I came across some sweet makers working. They were buzzing. Now what kind of sweet makers buzz? Well, that's today's nature mystery. The case of the buzzing sweet maker. Let's check out my field notes for three clues to help you solve the mystery. Clue number one. A lovely meadow indeed. Now for clue number two. Honeycomb! Check out this honeycomb! That's it, nature detectives. Clue number three. That's right! In the meadow, you found a honeycomb and the wings of a bee. So what's with this buzzing sweet maker? Bees make sweet honey. You got it! Bees buzz around the meadow, gathering nectar from flowers to make honey. Beautiful. Now let's pause and have a mindful moment. Did you know bees not only make honey, they help plants, fruit, and flowers grow? We can be thankful and show our gratitude by respecting their habitat so they can be busy bees. Yummy! The next time you taste honey, eat an apple, or see flowers in a garden, be sure to thank those bees for making these gifts for us. See you soon, Gumboot Kids! Good night, Scout! Hi, 
Gumboot Kids. Hi, Daisy. I love having bugs come visit my garden. Today, I saw a beetle, an ant, and a spider. They inspired me to make a nature craft. Would you like to make a bug hotel, Gumboot Kids? Yay! <laughs> Step one, collect some bug-friendly nesting materials. Try sticks, bark, pine cones, and leaves. I found some tree bark and some sticks. Pine cones. Check these out, Daisy. Terrific! Step two, get some craft supplies, like a wooden box or a shoe box. Ideally, your box should have small compartments, or you can make your own. Like this? Yes! <laughs> Step three, Build your bug hotel by placing your nesting materials into the box. Layers are best. I found some burlap. That will work. Terrific! I'm gonna cut up some sticks. Here's some cardboard. I'll help you. Bugs love nooks and crannies, so pack it in. And remember, there is no right or wrong way to make a nature craft. So have fun! A bug hotel is a place where bugs can live and hibernate in the winter. Giving bugs a place to live in your yard encourages them to pollinate the plants and help your garden grow. Bugs are just gonna love it. Nice construction work, Gumboot Kids! Now, let's see what you've made. Well done! The best time to set up your bug hotel is in the autumn. Put it near the garden and the bugs will move in for the winter. And it looks like you've already got your first guests. Ooh, wow. Cool! Daisy's Bug Hotel is officially open for business. I can't wait for my guests to arrive. <laughs> See you next time, Gumboot Kids. Goodbye, Daisy. Day -a -wa -a -day -a -wa -day Today, day a day a daisy, I bet we'll make something great. Who makes the flowers grow? Bees. Who makes the honey sweet? Bees. Who makes the nectar flow? Bees. Who makes the honeycomb? Bees. Who makes the royal jelly? Bees. Who are the pollen fairies? Bees. Who makes the clover grow? Bees. Who makes the apples sweet? Bees. Who makes the peaches pink? Bees. Who makes the cotton grow? Bye.